Elon Musk continues to be an absolute savage and it's driving all of the elites crazy even though he has more money than all of them. And as you see right here on Twitter, 14 minutes after the tweet was made, Elon Musk destroying Bill Gates. I might title this Elon Musk ends Bill Gates' career. Obviously, that's not happening, but he is roasting them. And I think that's that new emoji from the Apple Store that they introduced for a pregnant man, I think. Um, I don't use Apple products. I use Android, but I'm sure Android will probably add that nonsense at some point too. But I love that Elon Musk continues to ruffle the feathers of all of these powerful elites and it drives them crazy. Obviously, you see the world dictator on human health, Bill Gates right here. That's the authority right there. That's the guy we're supposed to be listening to about health. That guy right there. But, but we can't have Elon Musk Owning Twitter, no, 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 that would be terrible, that would be awful, but we have to listen to that guy about our health. That's the guy to determine what humans should do to stay healthy. Okay, that makes sense. I love that. And then you've even got Mr. Beast in on it. Like, it's wonderful to see so many people just having fun on the internet, which is what the internet is for. Uh, there's an absolute meltdown in Elon Musk's uh, comments. You know, uh, <laughs> Odyssey literally had a boner and now it's gone. But I needed it. Thanks, Elon. <laughs> Is this the guy people want to buy Twitter? He'd ruin the app and freedom of speech. That's probably a troll. I would have to imagine that's a troll. I can't imagine someone being that out of touch, but again, it is Twitter, so you never know. And we are talking about emojis with pregnant men. Um, but I, I do, I love this. I love what Elon Musk is doing. Earlier when we were on Friday Night Tights, he actually even said, he tweeted this, uh, the barbarians are at the gate. I don't know if that implies anything, but he's continuing to show that he is 100% serious. Now he's proven that he is 100% serious with his bid to buy Twitter. Will it happen? I don't know. And it's just fun watching the meltdown. It's just fun watching all of these weirdos cry and lose their minds over the potential of Elon Musk owning Twitter and making it a private company. That was always their NPC response to all of this. Private company can do whatever they want. Well, now you have the man who's the richest man in the world saying, I want to buy Twitter and make it a private company. And suddenly that is a problem because with the left and with social justice, there's never any consistency to their arguments. It's always just to lose their minds over whatever they can lose their mind to, take the latest NPC update, apply that to whatever else they were supposed to be spewing that day, and here we are. So we'll continue to follow this with Elon Musk, but I'm loving every single second of it. And the meltdown has been glorious, just to say the least, because there's been so much more that's going along with this, with Netflix and their stock dropping, Disney and their stock dropping, You've got Ron DeSantis standing up to Disney. You've got CNN Plus going out of business. And all of this woke nonsense, all this leftist nonsense continuing to not show any sustainability, which is what we've continued to say about all of this. Anything that's based in identity politics, it's not going to last. It's temporary. And you're pandering to a group of people that will not support you financially. They will not do it. So we'll continue to monitor this. I hope you guys are having a great day. I appreciate your support here on Geeks and Gamers. Um, we've been doing a lot of live streams here. We've been doing a lot of live streams over on the Gaming with Geeks YouTube channel, playing video games over there. we got the Geeks and Gamers tabletop channel, Dungeons and Dragons. Park Hoppin' is on fire. That channel just hit its first 100K uh, video, 100,000 viewed video. Um, poor Choices. Uh, you got so many channels that we are connected to, and it's great to be a part of all of this. So thank you guys. Have a great day, and we will talk to you later.